They have the world's largest Coke can. That's what everyone told me when I said I'd be moving to Portage Library. I haven't been here long, but I've already learned that Portage has much more to offer than a giant can of pop. The first place I discovered when I moved here was the Portage District Library. The library here is a huge space of beautiful light, not to mention a great collection of books and movies. If you're brave enough to face the winter weather, walking around the city is a great way to make sure you see it all. Downtown has a variety of stores and shops, and Portage City Hall is a sight to see. It was designed by Thomas Fuller, the same man who designed the Parliament Buildings in Ottawa. The walking path on Crescent Road spans 24 blocks and has a lot to offer. Beautiful heritage homes line the street, and across the lake is the town's famous Dutch windmill. On the island across from the path is the city's brand new PCU center. The center has two arenas, a pool, a multi-purpose room, and a fitness center. It even hosted the 2011 World Under-17 Hockey Championships. Even without the center, the island is still worth exploring. It has an outdoor water park, playground, a retired fighter plane, and a reindeer pen. The deer hang out all year and are fun to try and spot from outside the pen. So for anyone thinking of checking out the city, be sure you see more than just the Coke can. For the Portage Daily Graphic, I'm Jamie Fisher.